What's up, cool people? I'm Matt Conroy. Welcome back to Darksiders Genesis. Okay, welcome back. And, um... So we left things off with Eden Prime being available. Also, I just noticed my power level is supposedly way high, comparatively. But also, it's been like that for a little while, which leaves me wondering why I had so much trouble in in the holdback. But anyway, I don't think I did too much in between episodes. I might have done a little bit more stuff in the arena, come to think of it. Um, might have also... I think I went back and 100 percent the Inferno Vault. Still can't quite with the Slag Pit, just because there's a certain ability I need for that that I apparently have not unlocked yet. Oh, Jovi! Hey, what's up? Been a while, yeah. Um, I've been doing pretty well. How about you? Um, while I give some details on how I've been doing, you can chime in with what you have to say. But also, I want to get into uh, the next mission here. So I don't delay the gameplay too long. But, uh, yeah, I've been doing pretty well. Just uh, mostly the same kind of stuff. I'm just playing this now instead of Digimon Survive. Although, I say instead of, I technically am still playing Digimon Survive. I've been putting videos up for that. I've been streaming the stuff from which those videos are derived over on Twitch. Um, so, uh, what? Hold up. I need to look at ammo types and stuff. Okay, that's gonna be first type. I'll still keep the charge shot as the second type. Anyway. Yeah, so I've actually been streaming, like, my New Game Plus playthrough of Digimon Survive over on Twitch. Um, kind of alongside my Bible study streams. Alright, what's going on here? Looks like War and Strife with their horses. It still burns after all this time. Right. It's a tomb. Remembering all the stuff that's no one should be here. happened at Eden. Tomb. Our tomb. Come rest with us, okay, hold up. I thought all the Nephilim were killed. How are the uh, there's some sort of weird like undead thing going on here, isn't there? Something has brought them also <laughs> get my face cam out of the way of Strife's face. Simple creature. Your brothers and sisters live by my will and die by my will alone. The will of Astarte. Astarte? Hmm. You were an angel charged with guarding Eden. Lucifer showed me a new path, a way to finally escape. And this Lucifer graveyard. again. You, however, will be buried here among the dead. So Lucifer, Lucifer's been making deals with a bunch of people. Uh, oh jeez, if I'm riding the horse, I guess the ammo type that I have equipped doesn't really matter too much, does it? Okay, so far there's not really too much going on in this fight. Oh, jeez. Other enemies in area, but still nothing too bad yet. Sorry, Jovi, I have very much gotten wrapped up in playing the game at this point. But yeah, I mean... We are not Nephilim. We are horsemen. But yeah, I've been just working and pretty much... Doing the same stuff I was doing before, it's just, you know. I'm playing a different game. Ouch! Playing a different game on here now, and, uh. Jeez. Okay. Am I supposed. Am I supposed to be able to get back on my horse now, or do I need to defeat this dude first?
does not seem to give me the option of getting back on Okay, now it does. You brought this upon yourselves! Is there any way that I can take damage from... I don't know. Call upon the dead. Seems odd that I could basically just, you know, follow her around and keep taking swipes like this without much happening. But now she's about to get off of the horse and do this thing again. Which I have no clue how I'm supposed to establish which way she's going with... Oh my gosh! Not sure how I'm supposed to handle that attack. Nephilim Brute. Okay. Nice. Okay. Horus is available once more. Actually, maybe I should switch characters first. Because, uh, yeah. War given his current state, actually has a chance at healing while he's inactive. By my power, I command you to rise! Meanwhile, I can keep picking up the health orbs to heal up Strife a little bit. Again, how am I supposed to be able to determine where she's coming from? And where she's gonna go with that? Like, trying to figure that out is, I don't know. Try, worse than trying to figure out where Cotton Eye Joe went. <laughs> Sorry, that was just the reference that came to mind with the way I was wording things there for a second. Fuck on it. Damn you, study. Good golly. You are this is probably up to this point the hardest battle I've been in in this game. Uh, okay, so it seems like for the most part I pretty much can't stay. in one spot for too long. I mean, that definitely seems to be true. Okay, cool. I completed a side mission of getting executions on all the Nephilim. Great. So now what? For the Nephilim, I will strike you down! There we go. I command you to rise! Rise! Okay, so it seems like maybe it's a little more difficult to just follow her. Okay, you know what? Holy cow! The way they were just comboing off on me there. It's kind of ridiculous. But you know what? There. Anarchy form. I defeat you.
Okay, now what? Do I need to do something over here? Oh. Uh, no. I was to be vengeance. Vengeance? You turned our fallen brothers into your playthings. I'll show you vengeance. You goddamn monster. I wish her dead as you do, brother. But we must keep our wits. The council will want answers. You've the nerve to call me monster. But what of the blood on your hands? Not another word, angel. You're nothing more than butchers. Filthy traitors who destroyed your own kind. And for what? The balance. <laughs> I pity you, horsemen. And you, Strife. I know you're fast. So much for keeping her alive. There was nothing more to learn from her. We'll search elsewhere for signs of Lucifer and his dealings. That was... Huh. More listen. What she said... Whatever secrets she bore, I'd sooner hear from your own lips. Someday, I'll tell you everything. Someday, so will I. Okay then. Well, that got more than a little, uh... Holy cow, ramp- uh... Path to your target will explode after a delay, dealing very light damage based on wrath power. Enemies killed by world ender will explode- jeez. What even are those? Those sound like... Like ultimate move kind of things. But anyway... Are there any other side missions to do here? No. I guess I completed all those. Sweet. Um. But yeah, also got a new monitor that I hopefully sometime soon will be able to use. Right, I gotta hold that to... Horsemen have defeated Astarte. So yeah. Once I get a better uh, desk situation figured out, upon which I could use two monitors, then I'll be using those during my streams. It is as we feared. Eden is tainted by Lucifer's dark influence. He is not yet finished with that dead world. It holds many more secrets he might shape to his purpose. By now, others have entered Eden by Lucifer's pathway to aid him. Then we must sever the pathway. This is no simple task. I would require, for starters, an item of immense angelic power. And what angel would aid us? I More fetch quests for Volgrim, yay! But given the like mission style of this game. But Heaven I guess it brought its most powerful weapons to kind of suits that a bit better. Nebulum in Eden. Perhaps there, among the dead, you might find such a relic. Yes, the Elder Stone. Elder, what now? The Elder Stone is divine power in its purest form. Bring it to me, and perhaps we can seal off Lucifer's gateway. Back to Eden, then. Great. Bastion's Fall. Horsemen must return to Eden to find the Elder Stone, a powerful artifact that will allow them to close Lucifer's portal. That doesn't seem anywhere near as bad as Eden Prime looked, though. Like, just in terms of the overall state of it. Alright. Please let this be the last time we set foot here. Agreed. Let us retrieve the Elder Stone so we may be done with this place. Well, I could... I could tell you in the broader story that spans across, you know, the other games in this series, 
it will for sure not be the last time war ends up in this place. Okay, what's up with these? Okay. Jeez, even just like these basic kind of enemies seem pretty tough, relatively speaking. Grubbling increases wrath power by 1%. Okay, cool. And kablam. I totally thought that was going to hit the bigger insect back there, too. But oh well. Uh, I am almost definitely only going to be able to get partway through this mission during the particular, you know, roughly 30 minute recording that I'm doing just because of how much there tends to be in each of these missions. <laughs> Also, these trees being in the foreground and in the way of me seeing the enemies. Not particularly helpful. I mean, it is nice that they give you at least, you know, outlines of characters and enemies and whatnot. You know, behind the stuff that's in the foreground, but still. Just not having this other stuff in the foreground would kind of be better. Yeah, there's definitely something going on with these. Is there more that I need to... Oh. Hello. Ah. A trickster key. Alrighty. I assume that's all that I can get from that. Yeah. Okay, then. Yeah, so figuring out a suitable uh, desk replacement for what I currently have going on is proving to be slightly more complicated than I thought it would be. War, do these angels look... Or maybe I should just say slightly more no telling what difficult. Lucifer has wrought here, but we must end it. Yeah, let's start with these guys. Because, you know, as I was shopping earlier today at Walmart, uh, you know, I mean, I saw some desk options, and width-wise, they might have been all right, but... I also would have been losing about a third or more of the depth that I have access to relative to this particular setup that I have right now. Which may or may not be a bad thing. I don't know. Corrupted Angel increases Strife's ammo capacity and War's Vorpal Blade damage. Ow! Oh my gosh! Why are archers always the worst enemies in this game? Like, come on! Alright, wrath abilities like crazy. Horseman, you dare to return here. Abaddon? Abaddon, still stuck here, I see. It is not by choice that we return. You have been here since the war? Since the slaughter, yes. Charged with guarding this realm from further invasion. Protecting its secrets from heathens, such as yourselves. We are here for Lucifer. By the look of things you've already met. 
He overwhelmed my forces, spread corruption within our ranks. Even Astarte, my greatest warrior, has turned. We've already dealt with Astarte. I really wish these characters so wouldn't whisper so much at times. I suppose I should thank you. That monster you faced was not Astarte. Thug on it, there's all there goes all the health I was hoping to get. I may not have found the strength to strike her down as my enemy. You've done me a service, but evil still spreads through our ranks. Corrupted angels overwhelm our forces. Destroying them would be a mercy and a blow to Lucifer's ambitions here. Do this while I seek out the source of the corruption. We will destroy what corruption we find, so long as it does not delay our mission. A temporary alliance, then. We got a lot of those lately. Yep. <laughs> and that just happens a lot in general throughout the series. These quote-unquote temporary alliances. And like any good gamer, of course, I have to break all the things. Uh, was that something I was maybe supposed to try? Save the angels from their corrupted brethren. Okay, way to be descriptive there. I would guess that mostly just means, you know, kill all the corrupted angels. Those are regular angels. Holy cow. Oh, jeez. See, that keeps happening, and I keep getting worried that I'm gonna, like, fall off the edge there. But you came to my aid, defended my angels. I suppose that makes us allies. We always fight to uphold the balance. The demons grow more audacious with each passing day. I wonder how long this fragile balance will last. Ah, that's what I love about you, Abaddon. You always look on the bright side. <laughs> okay, so does that mean... Oh, I completed the side mission. Alright. I thought that was going to be more of an ongoing thing throughout the level. Um, okay, so some kind of bridge. Just, ah. So yeah, this, this symbol right here, I still have not unlocked the way to utilize that. And that's part of the reason I can't 100% complete uh, mission number two as of yet. As well as probably some others. Okay. Oh, I missed a boatman coin way back there. Eh. I can go back and get it later, I suppose. Altar to the Creator. Oh, hello. Maybe this will give me the ability to use those U shaped things? Ether Spark. 
When activated at an ether platform, sends out a spark that can be controlled to seek out and power up inactive ether panels. Uh, when activated without an ether platform, fires out a spark for a short distance that will snare enemies. Okay, so that seems to be a strife thing. Gotcha. Uh, Press in the right stick at an ether platform to send out a spark that can be controlled to seek out and power up inactive ether panels. Okay, so the U-shaped thing is the platform, the panels are the ones that look kind of like masks. Gotcha. Uh, press it when not on a platform to fire out a spark for a short distance that will snare enemies. That looks a lot like the thing that goes on the enemies when I use Strife's Y attack. I'm no expert, but I'd say this must be the Elder Stone. It contains enough divine power to shape worlds. It must be wielded with care. Great power. Responsibility? Spider-Man? <laughs> Murderers! We will avenge a starting! Your presence defiles this place. Execution, yes, please. Step into the light. Okay. Angel Champion. Dashing deals minimal damage based on attack. Okay. But hey, damage is damage. Alrighty, so. I do this. Oh, and I have to use the left stick to control it. Okay. And that's how I reopen that pathway, and I can make my way on back now. Okay. But then there's more. Let's return now. Let Volgrim know to prepare. Horseman, wait! You must lend us your strength. Help me cleanse this place. I think we've done enough cleaning for one day. We could finish this strike. Perhaps our fallen brethren may also find peace. I really don't want to stick around here. Do you? Besides, every second we waste here, Lucifer gets farther away. Listen. Atop this spire, there is an abomination. He spreads corruption amongst my brothers and sisters. I dare not send more of my soldiers against it. Those who have fallen now fight at its side. Ascend this spire and destroy it. Consider it done. Okay. Uh, so these basically just turn into big old, like, hey, move the ball through the puzzle thing without hitting the sides. Did that actually activate it? I'm not sure. I feel like I might have missed. Let's try again, just to be sure. Because it didn't really show... Oh, yeah. I'm pretty sure I missed. Because otherwise there would probably be a platform showing up there. Huh. It seems like the longer this thing goes, the more that it speeds up. Okay. I, w I was trying to, like, you know, hold 
I was trying to see if I could move it like backwards in order to maybe slow it down. But that doesn't seem to be an option. There we go. Um... I don't know how much more there's actually going to be in this place. How much have I... Oh, it seems like there's still a lot that I have left to collect, especially in terms of boatman's coins. So... You know what? I might actually leave the recording off at that, go back and get this boatman coin, and then pick back up from where I am here currently. All right, so we went to Eden Prime and then fought uh, Astarte, who had, through some power given by Lucifer, raised up a small army of Nephilim who had been dead, but, you know, they were brought back to life by this power. Anyway, we fought her, beat her, that was all taken care of, uh... But we realized there was more stuff going on with Eden and, you know, war and strife are really intent on trying to cut off the 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 link, the path to Eden, which requires them going back to Eden, but to like a different section of it. And we find some corrupted angels and all sorts of crazy stuff happening. But anyway, uh, we'll be picking up on that part in the next episode. Um, so yeah, as always, like, share if you enjoyed the video, subscribe to the channel, if you're on YouTube, click the bell to get updates when I post new videos, look down in the description to get info on other social media pages and all that good stuff, and leave comments below there with any thoughts you have. So that's going to do it for now, hope you're all doing well, hopefully I'll see you for the next video, but until then, stay cool people.